There's a stay at home order in the state of Colorado and people who are homeless cannot stay at home. You're going to get bumped by somebody non intentionally. Nate Verner has been homeless for 20 years and says he has never seen shelters as packed as they are now. But it's getting more and more aggressive with the lack of places that were allowed to go and the places that were allowed to go we're shoulder to shoulder. Each night, Nate and thousands of others in the homeless community are forced to decide if they're going to sleep in a shelter with other sick people or out in the cold. Therese Howard of Denver Homeless Out Loud says the Colorado Department of Public Health and Environment has a duty to protect the health and safety of all Coloradans. They are not fulfilling that duty um, by leaving people who are homeless in situations that are um, entirely the opposite of, of what our, our world, um, every major health organization in the world, um, including the CDPHG, um, are advising um, that folks do. The mandate filed Wednesday is demanding the court to step in and require currently vacant residences, apartments, and hotels to open their doors to those experiencing homelessness. They're asking for an emergency hearing under Rule 106. And they're saying, look, court, you have the power to tell this ed this uh, agency what to do. And they're saying, use your expertise and come up with other ways to uh, help us. Nine News legal expert Whitney Trailer says, while an extreme measure under Governor Polis's emergency stay at home order, there is legal backing to request privately owned properties to house the homeless, but it's an uphill battle. Trailer says the next step is the agency will get served. Most likely this will happen tomorrow and then the judge will set a hearing as soon as possible. Denver Homeless Out Loud says they plan to send a letter, a letter directly to Governor Polis to appeal to their cause. I reached out to the governor's office this afternoon for comment and they said they will not comment on pending litigation.